Good evening. Um, it's 6.45 on Monday the 18th of November and it's time for today on my boo journal. I actually wasn't going to do a video today because my shoulder's still a bit sore. Um, and quite frankly, I'm enjoying the rest of not doing it. Do you know what I mean? And... Um, but then I thought, well, I've got to come in here and do it anyway. And I'd been playing about in my journal in the other room, just trying a couple of things out. And I thought, well, I might as well come in here and fill it all up and just record it. And then I would do a quick edit job rather than a, a bloody great long one. So I apologise if I don't cut some bits out or I cut some bits out and it doesn't make sense. So yesterday, do the challenges. I can't. Yes, I did. Oh, I, uh, I went live, didn't I? Yeah, so I did. Okay, so the challenges we did. I did have drinkies. And I probably have one in the can. I had chips because we had takeaway, didn't I? Did I craft? Well, I made a book, so. Is that right? Uh, I'm on the right one. Day face cream, makeup, challenges, booze, can, chips, craft. Yay! Need to add an about today. Is that right? Oh, it's the letter underneath. And I did my night care routine. So um, I've had somebody asking me about um, their daughter wants to make a YouTube channel. So I'm going to point her to this video and I apologise if I swear because I would like you to show this to your daughter okay and I'm going to tell you at the end if I remember to do so I will try and remember to do so I'll tell you at the end exactly how long this video is and you can compare that with the end product now I'll try and make this a standard video that I do and you can see in where I, I sped it up it's called hyperlapsing where I speed it up um, you can hear you should be able to hear nice little background tune going on and stuff like that i also recommend that you go and you find other youtubers that do the kind of thing that she's interested in doing okay and tell her to watch them get some ideas and to try various different things so i am going to try and control my potty mouth and hopefully we can get through this hopefully uh i won't be doing a card today Excuse me, just one moment. Go to bed. I'm not online. Go to bed. Thank you. Down. Thinks I'm online because he can hear me talking. And even though I'm recording, I'm not online. So there's no point in him coming down because there will not be gizzers. Uh, right, this was yesterday. I'm just doing yesterday, not today. Okay. Um, I forgot to turn the downstairs light off, so... It's lit up upstairs. Okay. I'm doing well today. Are you eating again? She always waits until I'm either online. Sorry about the noise. Or um, recording before she like eats or drinks or does something that makes a great deal of noise. So a few things that you will want to take into account, young lady is that you want, you know, a decent place to record. You want something with good light to show what you're doing because you don't want shadows, okay? Um, you do not need two cameras. This this camera here, the big one, the, the little one, sorry, um, was something I came up with a couple of months ago and it seems to be quite popular because a couple of other people have sort of taken it up. You don't need to do that unless you really, really want to, but that means, like, mum's looking at another camera for you and she's going to shoot me for saying that. <laughs> you need good light, okay? Daylight bulbs are better than yellower bulbs. Um, what else do you need? Um, I don't know, I'll think as I go. Right, yesterday, I didn't. I don't think I did anything again yesterday. Uh, dreadful, isn't it? 
I didn't clean the loo yesterday. I forgot. I put the dishwasher on, that was about it. You need to not have a five-year-old going, Mum, every five seconds. Now, I posted... When did I post? It also helps if you've got your... um. Uh, got all your ideas together and you know what you're doing. So I posted the tour tracker and I posted the Instagram tracker yesterday. So... I don't think I actually added that one in here. Card of the day. New Insta track, yes I did. I changed that one the other day, didn't I? So I posted that yesterday so I can colour that in in yesterday's pen. Also, while you're um, while you're videoing, it it's a good idea to explain what you're doing and why you're doing it, because people that, especially if you're doing tutorial type videos or videos like this, people that come to your channel come to maybe see how to do it. Yeah, I'm just going to change a pen. For example, I use a different pen every day to colour code. Yeah, so like on this tracker that you've just seen me fill out. All of these are in different colours. That denotes what day that I used it. And I used to, but I don't anymore, and I will do it for this one. If you click the eye that is about to appear up in the corner, that will then show you a link to another video that explains why I colour code. Okay? Doing that kind of thing is always helpful. But obviously, the more editing you do, or the more stuff like that that you add in, the longer the editing process. Now, a video, for me, usually takes an hour of filming it then takes at least another hour for me to edit it because I've got to watch it again I've got to watch it all the way through to find all the places where I I found out I've got this really bad habit of going when I'm thinking and I was like oh my god I didn't know I did that and I still I'm not aware when I'm doing it and I watched my video back and I went I made that blooming noise again <laughs> so I have to I edit those out you know I say um an awful lot and I say so all the time and it winds me right up and I've given up trying to edit that out because it just does my head in um, um. <laughs> I don't have a script I say the same thing at the beginning the same thing at the end and that's pretty much it the rest of it is a fly by the seat of my pants type thing sometimes I forget what I'm doing and like this and I sit and I gabble at the camera and everybody's sitting here looking at the same page in my book which in the planner world is a huge no-no because people hate that kind of thing so try not to let you distract yourself yeah right today i have this is my task tracker this is something things that i like to try and do every single day as you can see i'm not very good at that second to last one and that is to do um some lift some weights every day to try and get a little bit fitter and i don't do that for various other reasons mainly because i forget um, all of this week I've had a trap shoulder nerve, so that hasn't happened. I've done day face cream and I've worn some makeup. I won't do that today because it's a bit late in the day. So, this is my mood tracker and my pain tracker. So, my mood... I'm going to put it about there. Um, my pain, my pain is a little better today. I've got a little bit more movement today than I had yesterday, which is like huge plus because ouch. Now I need to know my sleep for today was. So I went to sleep. Oh my rulers are hitting each other. At. 11.45, I got up just before 7, and I was awake, that's right, I came down and got a drink because I had a bit of a headache starting, I remember that, but other than that, it was actually a better night. One other thing you need to be aware of as well is if you're filming like this with an overhead camera and you're doing something artistic, or well anything, is to not lean like that over what you're doing <laughs> yeah ask me how I know the first video I recorded a good half of it was unusable because my head was in the way and uh, I was so upset but you know you learn I still do it I still get my head in the way you learn after a bit um, 
where the point is where you shouldn't take, pu push your head in any further. It's just something you pick up as you go. Right. Um, today I cleaned the loo and I've done the laundry. Oh, I need to. Oh, I can't clean the TV. I've run out of kitchen roll. Dishwasher's filled in, uh, filled up, but I haven't turned it on yet, so not to worry about that. Okay, we are in the new week, girls and boys. Oh crap! Right, uh, carpet quote happened earlier. Kyle's play is happening as we speak. Mary's on a bit later. Awesome, awesome. Dog's got her hair cut tomorrow. There's an open day. I'd forgotten about that. Right. Okay. See, I just, I just heard myself doing that. That's annoying. Right, I need to put in there that I'm going to do a live on Wednesday so I can set up for next week. Phone appointment. Right. So, right, we're finished in that journal. Time to get the chunk out. Now. This is my chunk journal and for the benefit of the hopefully people new people watching this I made this okay um, your mum might remember me stating the first week or two we were there that I'd made a book a junk journal and that's what this is but I call it a chunk journal because it's so big and I made it using um, a box that Toy Story characters came in that I bought for Daryl now today I decided to have a go with these, my deco scissors, to roughen the edges up. Now the fact that there's a little bit of paper in there tells you how it went. It went dreadfully and I did the entire second signature except that bit because I didn't want to cut off Friday. And I don't really like it. I don't know why I don't like it. It was really hard to do as well. I had a lot of places where the scissors just wouldn't cut through and I thought well these are rubbish you know I'm going to send them back and I was livid and angry but then every time I went to try them again on like through the middle of a piece of paper they cut fine so my only um conclusion is that it's either the fact that I've dyed the paper using tea and coffee or that I was doing it on the very very edge I don't know I really don't know so I'm gonna see how I feel about this after a month or so when it's all filled in and um, go from there and in the end what I ended up doing was folding two two sheets and so I was essentially cutting through four because I was doing one at a time was doing my absolute nut in and I can't think of any other way to make it easier for me I have got a, a tearing ruler but I was I wanted to be so close to the edge I just couldn't get hold of it and if I tried to trap the smaller bit it just pulled it out from underneath it so I don't because I don't want to lose the space you know I don't know I don't know what's that noise again <laughs> so frustrating right anyway that's beside the point let me draw in for today gosh be careful doing that Got knobbly bits on the front to close it. This is glass mat. Okay, so here's a small size pit artist pen for this, and a stencil that I ordered online and had sent to one of my lovely American friends who then posted it on to me because the seller did not want to send to the UK, which I thought was rude. That little middle bit there moves because it's so thin and when you're when you're it actually like as you're running up the side of it it's blooming annoying okay so um bum, 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 bum. i screenshot the weather at midday sunshine high of eight and a low of zero Do, do, do. So, um, 
down to discuss a trek. You discovered Shrek yesterday. I guess what we've just watched. Um, I put in a TV ban a week or so ago because it was getting to the whole um, arguing whenever I wanted to turn it off and if we wanted to watch something and all that lot. So we actually spent the whole weekend without a single Disney film, without a single Paw Patrol or you know Transformers I, I just I wouldn't allow I didn't have anything to do with children on all weekend we did have the TV on um, because Alex was playing Star Wars and Daryl sat absolutely entranced by it all, all Saturday he was he literally sat there and watched the whole day um, which was fantastic you know <laughs> he got a little bit like mm, yesterday about it all and um right got a high of eight and a low of freezing and um i allowed him after dinner uh, alex had gone to training to sit and actually watch a film and that's when i put shrek on because it literally came up on the tv and i said here go watch that i don't want to watch it i said you watch that or nothing Oh, and it had already been on for like 10 minutes but it caught his attention and he loved it um, sunrise was 07.24 sunset was quarter past four and um, yeah it's like today he'd come home Alex again had the playstation in the uh, lounge so there was no you know no argue. he didn't even bother arguing he just said oh can I watch my film later I said you can watch film while you eat your dinner all right then he's been as good as gold see I love how that looks against the washi in the background I'm just not sure how I'll you know how it looks there whether whether they've all been done I think I need a new one of those because that has been giving me so much travel past month so that makes a nice drop shadow around my letters and then what I do every day is I do um, challenge so that I can practice my calligraphy oh that's not good that's lifted that right up there I'm going to glue that washi down because it's it has failed me the trouble is with um, tea and coffee dyed paper is that it is um, acidic and it's very very dry so while the tape itself is still quite sticky it just can't cope with the dryness of the paper that's why it's lifted so just give that a little bit of help okay so the word for today is teen feast now thanksgiving is very soon isn't it is it the 28th because that's what day this is to write thanksgiving on i don't know do. yeah being english i don't know these things right so what i'm going to do I was like, what's feast? Yeah. I wonder if it might fit up there actually. I'm trying really hard to stay relaxed for this shoulder, but it's not working. It's starting to hurt now. This is my little bit of get my pen working paper. This as well. This seems to dry out when it's not being used. Lovely. Right, so. Okay, that has put me at 25 minutes and 10 seconds. Okay, um, I'm going to edit it. So I will speed up the bits like where I just wrote Feast. I'll make that just a little bit faster. Um, I will add in a little bit of fancy writing at the beginning just to say welcome. Um, I will add what's called my end screen, which is the, the 
shot right at the very very end of the video and that's where you can add in once you get to the uploading stage um on youtube you can you add that bit in on youtube that's the there'll be an icon of me appearing about here my most recent video will appear up in this corner and then down in this corner where this book is um more like this videos will appear this book down here is also something that is clickable and allows you to subscribe to my channel if you wish to do so and i say all that at the end as well all right just to remind people i don't like to say it at the beginning because i don't like it when people do that at the beginning you know um somebody that i watch has just got this new thing where she has her instagram appear here with this clicking noise it goes like a photograph sort of click noise and then her instagram handle appears at the top of it again with the click noise i find that personally really annoying i hate it so you know but she's a lot bigger than i am she's got thousands and thousands you know 40 or thousand subscribers i've got 100 and whatever it is six i think it is i can't remember um was it 200 206 <laughs> so she's got a lot more than i have i personally don't like that but that's you know personal preference i don't like videos where people don't talk yeah i don't like videos where it's just somebody showing you you know oh, i'm going to paint this picture and they just put on music background music and they and they just get on with it i'm like well what color is that why are you using that what does that do how thick are you putting that on do you need as much water as that what brush is that what canvas are you using do you know what i mean stuff like that and that information's not being relayed she's not or he, she or he would not be relaying how it feels and all of that kind of thing you know that's why i like videos where there's talking either all the way through or like i do through most of it um i do the occasional video where i'll hyperlapse the entire thing and that's usually when i'm doing what i call my monthly setup and my monthly setup is the the other journal and that is when I do all of the the first pages, you know, so there'll be um, my calendar, my trackers and all because this this could take a couple of hours. And sometimes I do it during live and sometimes I will do a video and I'll hyperlapse it. Um, and then I'll talk over it to say, oh, yeah, this is what I'm doing here. I use these pens. I do, you know, blah, 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 blah. And I still try to tell people what I'm using. I don't do that often, tell people what I'm using during these kind of videos because everything is listed down below. And if it's not, all you've got to do is say, well, what was that pen you used to do so and so and so and so? I think the, actually the only thing that's not listed is my click few pen. And this was just a cheapy one that I got in the range. So, yeah. Um, and that's pretty much it. Okay. If you or mum have any questions, you can either leave them down below or you can ask me at school. All right hope this has been helpful for you i'm now at 28 minutes and 47 seconds okay okay guys thank you so so much for joining me today i really appreciate it you know i do i always do um i really hope that this young lady does watch this video and if she does could you guys please say congratulations to her because she has off her own back just arranged um a sale and she's raised over 1200 pounds for cancer research and she did this all by herself okay i'm i'm you know she's she's young she's preteen okay and she did this all by herself she made the local paper uh, she's been on the radio the local radio and it's fantastic and we're all really really proud of you darling we really really are um amazing thing to do at that age i i'm so impressed it is unbelievable and I wanted to tell you on Wednesday, but I didn't want to embarrass you, which I thought, you know, possibly would. So being able to do this via the screen, you get to watch this in private. Okay. I'm going to say congratulations down below, guys. All right. Um, yeah, that's it. I'm going. I was. There's not going to be an evening edition. I'm just trying this format for a while, doing it in the evenings, so that I'm not sat here for as long. Um, I will be back tomorrow, as per uh thank you so so much for watching if you've got any comments questions suggestions silly things you want me to try dares you, you, you know put it down below hey i might even do it <laughs> uh if you click the book you will be subscribed and if you hit the bell that then appears down below you'll be notified when i upload new content don't forget to leave daryl some kisses down below because you know he loves them it's the first thing we check in the morning um 
Have a fantastic rest of your day. I will be back in Tuesday's edition of Today in my Boo Journal. Take it easy, guys.